Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 40, and this is war number nine. Going up against an alliance called uh, Cable or Cabal uh, Apocalypse. All right, let's see who they've banned. Ooh, I don't see Gallon banned, so you know he's coming in. Perfect, beautiful, all right. Uh, let's uh, spectate here, see what we got. I take path three. All right, ooh. Okay, so I don't think there's any issue with Longshot uh, and Gallon right there. Uh, so Gallon for sure. Uh, Man Thing, I believe, is going to be taken by uh, one of my alliance mates. And you see that I Doom, infamous Iron Man? Yeah, I got something for him. So that's going to be me. All right, now this guy right here, this is interesting. Now, because I had an issue with him before and I had to learn him, I know that that's a good placement. So I need to have somebody who is bleed immune for sure on that node. And then we've got Kingpin. And then uh, Cersei, I believe, will be taken by someone else as well. Uh, Boss Island is usually handled, um, but if I have somebody that is good for it, um, hopefully they'll let me know and then I'll go in. But, so Claire is not going to be great for this, because we already know about him now. So, I'll have Gallon. Gallon um, can take out this long shot. Um, and then for I Doom, we already have seen that Overseer does a really good job here. So I'm going to bring him in. And so that just leaves somebody for this path. Now, Gallon could probably do this node right here. Okay. He could probably do that. Uh, I don't believe, um... Kingpin gets armor ups. So we shouldn't have to worry about the shock. Uh, I will verify that before I go in. Uh, but this one right here, Cap Sam Wilson, that's the problem uh, fight that I'm seeing here. And he's going to have an armor up. So I definitely need somebody that is bleed immune. And I do have several uh, options for this fight. So um, we'll see. I'll try to bring in a Bleed Immune that can do both of these fights. And um, yeah, so Gallon and Overseer are a definite uh, Hulk Buster. I don't think Hulk Buster is Bleed Immune. If Hulk Buster is Bleed Immune, he will be coming in. Um, but I don't think he is. I know he's shock immune, and I believe he's poison immune. But I don't think he's bleed immune. So um, we'll we'll find somebody for this uh, this guy here, and hopefully they can do both paths. Uh, I mean the entire path. All right, let's get on with the fighting. All right, so you can see who I decided to go in with, absorbing man. So there were several options that I could have chosen. And I'm like, you know what? My absorbing man is rank four and I haven't tried him yet. And he's bleed immune. He also has something else that I found very, very useful, but more on that when we get there. So first fight is gonna be, of course, a gallon fight. And I wasn't sure how this was going to go. Now, I want you to notice the symbol. I'm already seeing some lag here. All right. Um, but anyway, we go on to long shot. Now, the one thing about long shot that I remember, I do not, if, if I'm not incinerate immune, I do not want to push him to a special two. 
That's usually insta-death. So that's what we're going to try and do. We're going to try to uh, bait out his special one. And it should not be a long fight. You know, medium, light, medium, because I don't believe he gets uh, armor up or anything. So medium, light, medium, medium, light, medium, until I have a decent amount. Heavy attack, special one or two, depending on where I'm at uh, at that time. But definitely want to bait out his special ones. All right, so uh, I, was, I was not really nervous, but I just couldn't think of the gotcha. You know, I'm like, okay, there's got to be some gotcha with him on this uh, node. And I was not really wanting to discover it. Because we are, once again, in super, super serious mode. Okay? Um, these guys are good. And it's close. We're, we're, we're doing okay. But it's close. Okay? Alright, here we go. Boom, boom. Alright, heavy attack. Boom. Doesn't matter. He can do all that he wants. He done. So, I didn't discover any gotcha. I guess if I had pushed him to a special two, then I would have had a real nasty gotcha. But other than that, um, honestly, I didn't even need Gallon. I could have taken him with someone else. So they may have just went ahead and put some easy folks on that path. Um, if I was going to take this man thing, which I'm not, um, I could have also uh, brought Human Torch. Uh, but anyway, as you can see, um, he lost one AB. Uh, it, it was, it was funny. He, um, he didn't wait till he put his, uh, kid to bed. And if you know anything about kids, they're going to find you. All right. Now look at this. You notice anything funny? My guy hasn't moved, but you can see the glowing dot to the next one. So he's actually not where it looks like he is. So I'm like, oh no, we coming out. And we restart in the game. You know, I had some uh, um, lag earlier. And I'm like, no. I am not going to go into this and then have some kind of crazy mess happen where I get disconnected in the middle of the fight or anything like that. So we restarted. And then I got a bunch of these. Great. Anyway, let's get back into it. Um, he lost that uh, attack bonus because... Uh, his kid found him when he was trying to hide to play. Uh, and you know, kids have a sixth sense. They do. You know? And so he was like, man, I'm so sorry, guys. I should have uh, waited until he was asleep. But it happens, you know? Um, so anyway, we remember iDoom. And we will be taking all iDooms going forward. Unlike some people. After I got my uh, butt whooped and uh, he took my manhood, I had to get it back. And now, every single time I see an eye doom, I'm taking him. That's just the way it goes. That's how I am. Uh, I, I, I get whooped up on, I'm going. In, in games, I was the same way. Guy that was beating me all the time, that's the same one I wanted to play all the time. Uh, but anyway... I've gotten pretty used to fighting him here. You see, I put a advanced power boost on so that I could fire off my special right away. And that takes down his uh, armor up. Um, but then he started acting like this, waiting for his armor up to come back. And I'm like, all right, fine. We'll hit you with another special. And I really didn't want to deal with his special too. All right. And I still evaded it, even though I wasn't unblockable. Because I want to practice. All right. See, there it is. But I'm evading it. I think I've got it now. Um, I had to practice a lot after I kept getting my butt whooped. And I'm like, no, 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 no. I got to learn how to evade this. So it's boom, boom, evade. So I got it. Okay. So even if he's, um, you know, unblockable, we're good. So that means I don't really have to use a subdue attacker, but he's still a great uh, option. 
Uh, and as far as I can do it, I'm going to do that. Because you never know when you will need to um, uh, take down his armor. All right. Done and done. It's starting to become pretty routine. Um, so I doom. When I'm there, he ain't getting all them kills he got that time. No suck. Now, this fight, I was nervous about. This is, I believe, Absorbing Man's debut. I don't remember taking him in to Alliance War before. And so I'm like, I think I did my homework. So let's see how this goes. All right. So we're going in. He's doing decent damage here. I'm not going to try light attack to extend his, um, you know, his form. But I want you to notice something. You know how uh, Cap Wilson likes to auto block, right? Look at my special one. After he does this, that is. See that? He ain't auto blocking that. Did you see his auto block pop up? But it was unblockable. That's what I was like, yeah. Okay. So I'm just like, yeah, this is great. Bait out his special, special one. Fire my unblockable. Just keep doing it. Watch, rinse, repeat. He's got a lot of um, glancing going on. So it's taking a little bit longer. But, you know, at this point, we're doing pretty well. I'm like, yeah. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Look at that. Another unblockable. Bam. Don't care about his auto block at this point. Okay. And I'm like, yeah, I think um, Absorbing Man is, is, is the one. Okay. Look at that. Unblockable. Bam. So I, at this point, I'm like, okay, we're good. All right. But right there, what just happened? Can somebody tell me what just happened there? I'm like, oh, no, you are not about to take this victory from me. But what happened there? Somebody let me know. I was doing unblockable special ones all this time. That one should have been the finishing unblockable special. And suddenly it wasn't. Was it because I was locked on and there's a chance for that? Because I was locked on before and I still did my unblockable. So I wasn't sure. Right at the end, suddenly it wasn't an unblockable special. So I just need to know that because that was a little scary to me. And I was about to say, maybe I shouldn't br have brought uh, Absorbing Man in for that, uh, you know, Cap Wilson. Uh, but anyway, here we go. Uh, I could have used somebody else. It didn't really matter at this point. Um, I could have used uh, Overseer. But why not use Gallant? He only got to fight one time. And uh, Kingpin is not... When Kingpin throws his specials, he's not a very difficult defender. However, if he don't want to fire that special one off, and if he tries to hold his special all the way to a special three, oh my goodness, no. All right, let's see if this will finish him off. No. I was like, dog, bite it. So now I got to bait this out. And we already know if we can just get to another uh, special one after I have at least 100. But we didn't need to. Just beat him down. All right. So that is it for my participation in this war. Um, Boss Island handled by others. Uh, and they didn't ask me uh, to help out or anything like that. So, uh, we'll be back in a moment. And uh, this war, very close. You'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And unfortunately, we lost this war. And it was a very, very close war. Uh, at one time, we were actually up by a few deaths. And we just could not seal the deal. Um, but very, very close. We win as a team. We lose as a team. I know folks feel bad uh, if they died. Don't feel bad if you're watching this. It happens. And we win as a team. We lose as a team. All right. So 
We're still in tier two. And our win streak of one, does that count as a win streak? Anyway, uh, is already over. So let's find out um, if we can uh, win the next few wars. Uh, we've got, what, uh, three, four, I think, four left uh, for the season. Uh, so let's see what we can do. I believe we are pretty solidly in uh, Platinum 2, which will be higher than I usually place. Uh, in my old alliance, we were three and four. You know, we usually did three, but I think one season we even did four. So it's been a while. I was in an alliance a long time ago uh, that was Platinum 1. But this will be the um, highest that I have been in years. All right, so that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And if you have any tips, tricks, anything like that for the fights, let me know. Definitely the answer to that fight with uh, Cap Wilson and uh, Absorbing Man. I'm still learning Absorbing Man. So let me know. Did something run out? And, you know, just let me know. All right, take care. And you all have a blessed day.